welcome back to my channel. This is Lizzie Bakes. Today I thought I would show you guys how I seal my painting. So I bought this from Michael's Mod Podge. I bought the gloss kind. It says it's eight ounces, 236 milliliters. Um, I think I paid nine dollars and some change for it and I've sealed almost all my paintings with it and I still have like half still left to go so first before I do it I roll it this is my fancy dancy roller baking roller that I purchased from Goodwill for one dollar so thought it was a steal. So I'm just gonna roll it to make sure everything's flat. Before you roll it though, make sure no drills. Oh, see, the drill came out up there. What is that one? I don't know why with the little lines. Hold on, the lighting in here could be desired. <laughs> I hate it when you go to look for something and you see it and then you go to look for it again and it disappeared. Now I don't know where it is. Now I don't know where it went. Hold it there. Why do I see it that way, but I don't see it this way? This is bizarre, people. This is real life happening here. Very bizarre. Craziness. How do I see it one way? Oh, there it is. I think it's seven. Oh, I bet you it's this one. No, nope, that's came out from there. All the diamonds are falling off this painting. Oh, it's a hot mess. Sorry about this, folks. <laughs> I think there is a Y, which is, sorry about that noise. It's my mini fridge that I keep my pop in that makes that noise. when you're trying to be lazy when you're trying to do this there we go I'm not even sure if that's the right one that's supposed to go there but it don't look that bad what do you think yeah I'm like talking to you like you can hear me or I can hear you Seven sixty two. Put it back. Okay. So let's try this again. Let's roll it. Get them all snapping into place. This is like really old diamond painting that I did like years ago. I never did steal it. Not years ago. I haven't been doing this for years. 
but it seems like a thousand years ago. So there, it's all flattened, it's all okay. So I usually pour this, I already did it, into a boat. I do it with the boats without the funnels, so it's nice. And then I just buy these cheap foamy brushes. You could purchase them at the dollar store or anywhere like that. Then I got <clears throat> a Tupperware with some water. So I'm going to dip the sponge in the water, get it nice and wet. Then I just go on to the glue with the water and you just start applying it. If it's too, if the glue is too, uh, solid, I notice it starts to pop drills. That's why you put the water on, so it doesn't pop the drills. And I just put it all on the canvas, and it will dry clear. And put a little bit more water, just like that. I don't really go one certain way, I just slap her on, slap it on. And once the glue dries, it will dry clear. Probably put way too much on. There. Then I just clean off those with water. Oh, got it on my finger. Yeah. I did buy this kind, the spray from Walmart. I don't really like it as much and it smells really bad. And I got the matte kind, which I think that's not very glossy. I don't know, but I tried it on my custom and it didn't really work very well. So, yeah, I don't know. But anyways, we'll come back when it's dry and we'll see how it looks. Hi, it's me again. Welcome back. And here you have it. It is now dry. And I don't think the Mod Pod makes the shine go, I think it's still pretty darn shiny. People, I know some people say it takes away the shine, but I don't think it does. I would never use the Mod Pod on the Diamond Art Club. Just because I don't know. I don't think I want to try. And they're guaranteed, so... I don't think I would even bother because they're probably, I'm going to put it behind glass so it won't matter. But if you're going to keep your painting out without glass on it, I suggest to use the Mod Pod for sure. So there you have it. I hope you enjoy this. I'm sorry about the little hiccup at the beginning. But I think it looks cute. I think it dried wonderfully. Another thing too, before you start putting that glue on, make sure that your canvas is clear of all debris. But I think it looks very nice. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to sub subscribe, Please subscribe to me. I'd be tickled pink. And remember, a little dabble do you. Have a great day.